Hi neighbor, hi upstairs. I can tell it that you're over the wooden panels. Wooden floor. Maybe I'm searching around for something. between roller coaster, gentle, swaying every which way and feeling a float a float in in flight <laughs> I used to write poetry for fun one of the first things I enjoyed in middle school, I would say. <laughs> I read some wacky, wacky weird poetry. Like, I think one of the poems was started like with a name, Mary Nan Markmill. Alliteration. try grasping on to my fingers just grasp onto them hold as, as long as you can I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna hold it on I'm gonna pull it, you pull it away pull my fingers away can you, can you follow along with me try to, try to, try to hold on Some random things I wanted to discuss or let her percolate. I don't know. 
how to sit properly. My, my posture don't. My chair. It makes these very non ASMR sounds. So sometimes uh, I try to I try to position myself in a way that will dramatically decrease the chance for that to happen. But I mean, it does what it wants to do. based on what I've seen from social media videos. Speaking of the world that we live in, social media and videos, sometimes we're talking about digital detoxing and needing to step away from all the Distractions, even though we live in this overloaded, over everything, extra everything. Like, oh yes, you gotta know about this. You gotta know about that. Because oh, oh, it will be super duper good for you. Like, let me convince you. Oh, just turning that off, turn, turn, turning that off. And then just different things. I I don't know. Quite articulate of a floating neuronal synapses or whatever doing their thing. Neurobiology. I find that when I was younger, I think I really appreciated the concept of neuroplasticity because a long time ago I did. I don't know if I mentioned before, but I had a minor TBI. Minor T, traumatic B, brain I, injury. Um, I mean, I have made around 600, I guess, plus videos. So I probably would have talked about it in at least one or two or three because I can be quite repetitive. <laughs> Rewinding, rewinding back. Um, yeah, neuro neuroplasticity. It's just yeah, beautiful the story. Um, even through as cliche as that sounds, like the different experiencing different adversities. We can grow our resilience and build new pathways, new connections. I want to find a different word for it other than connections because it sounds so hackneyed. Or what's it called? What's it called? For uh, right, right now, I don't have 2,000 subscribers, but I know it, I'm approaching that. And thank you for everyone who's um, just quietly watched and listened to me ramble or do some silly acting and whatever that floats through my mind or brain or throat and yeah I 
appreciate you guys. Appreciate you all. Um, and all the lovely notes of encouragement. Thank you for taking the time to support me. And I'm, I'm trying to find a better way, a more genuine way to say support or thank you. Hi neighbor, hi upstairs. I can tell about that tear over the wooden panels. Wooden floor. Maybe I'm searching around for something.
is right grasping on to my fingers just grasp onto them hold as, as long as you can just gonna, I'm just gonna hold it on I'm gonna pull it, pull it, pull it away pull my fingers away can you, can you follow along with me try to, try to, try to hold on Some random things I wanted to discuss or let her percolate. social media videos speaking of the world that we live in social media and videos it's times we're talking about digital detoxing and needing to step away from all the uh, distractions even though we live in this overloaded, over everything, extra everything. Like, oh yes, you gotta know about this. You gotta know about that. Because oh, it'll be, it will be super duper good for you. Like, let me convince you. Oh, just turning that off. Turning, turning that off. And then, different things I, I don't know how to quite articulate the floating neuronal synapses or whatever doing their thing neurobiology I find that when I was younger, I think I really appreciated the concept of neuroplasticity because a long time ago I did I don't know if I mentioned before but I had a minor TBI minor T traumatic B brain videos so I probably would have talked about it in at least one or two or three because I can be quite repetitive <laughs> and then okay back to the topic rewinding rewinding back um, yeah neuro neuroplasticity Experience 
facing different adversities, we can grow our resilience and build new pathways, new connections. I want to find a different word for it other than connections because it sounds so hackneyed. subscribers but I know it I'm approaching that and thank you for everyone who's um, just quietly watched and listened to me ramble or do some silly acting and whatever that floats through my mind or brain or throat appreciate you guys. appreciate you all. Um, and all the lovely notes of encouragement. Thank you for taking the time to support me. And I'm, I'm trying to find a better way, a more genuine way to say support or thank you. And hi, hi neighbor, hi upstairs. I can tell it that here over the wooden panels. Wooden floor. Maybe I'm searching around for something. say the crashing waves onto the shore it's like a mix between roller coaster gentle swaying every which way and feeling of 
float, a float and then flight. <laughs> I used to write poetry for fun. It was one of the first things I enjoyed in middle school, I would say. <laughs> I'd write some wacky, wacky weird poetry. Like, I think one of the poems was started like with a name, Mary Nan Marknell. Alliteration. try grasping on to my fingers. Just grasp onto them. Hold as as long as you can. I'm just gonna I'm just gonna hold it on. I'm gonna pull you pull it away. Pull my fingers away. Can you can you follow along with me? Try to try to try to hold on. Can you tell me what color? How do you describe the coloring of the, these frames? This is I know I said frame. Okay. Oh, my back. I don't know how to sit properly. My my posture though. My chair. It makes these very non-ASMR sounds. So, sometimes uh, I, try to, I try to position myself in a way that will dramatically decrease the chance for that to happen. But, I mean, it does what it wants to do. based on what I've seen from social media videos. Speaking of the world that we live in, social media and videos, it's sometimes we're talking about digital detoxing and needing to step away from all the Distractions, even though we live in this overloaded, over everything, extra everything. Like, oh yes, you gotta know about this. You gotta know about that. Because oh, it'll be, it will be super duper good for you. Like, let me convince you. Oh, just turning that off, turn, turn, turning that off. And then just doing things. I, I don't know how to quite articulate the floating neuronal synapses or whatever doing their thing. Neurobiology.
technology. I find that when I was younger, I think I really appreciated the concept of neuroplasticity. Because a long time ago, I did. I don't know if I mentioned before, but I had a minor TBI. Minor T. Traumatic. The brain. Plus videos, so I probably would have talked about it in at least one or two or three because I can be quite repetitive. <laughs> um, and then, okay, back to the topic. Rewinding, rewinding back. Um, yeah, neuro neuroplasticity. Thank you. 